Hello guys and welcome back to a new video. Today I'm right here at Mitsubishi Motors in Bern. If you are from Switzerland, you know about that. Uh, at Emil Fry Center, you can see it here. And I have right here with me the new Mitsubishi Outlander 2019 model. This is the benzene, uh, benzene version and I will try to review it interior, exterior and everything about this car so stay with me and we will do this in the next seconds so here i am guys with the key this is the key uh, of the new mitsubishi outlander um, it is a very light key with a nice chrome design here something that i want to show you first time is that the car have the newest keyless Entering in the car you have to have the key in your pocket and you just have to press this button and the car it's lock on all lock uh, Depend What you want to do? Anyway, the car look very nice. It is a very very big car with um, It take a lot of space in the parking plaza place also we have to, some chrome design around the car up there uh, that look very nice big windows great visibility also you can add some extra trunk up there um, The back of the car look very nice. We have parking sensors here in the back also um, This car come with the back camera. You can see it right here uh, So you can park it very easy. Also. We have here the fog lamps down here. We have again there the reverse light um, the exhaust pipe are under the car so we don't see any exhaust pipe here um, I like it more like that something like an electric car also here we have some plastic um, in the chrome color gray uh, gray plastic outlander logo and also Mitsubishi clear tech uh, on the other side here it's four wheel drive uh, also if you know already uh, uh, at the uh, Mitsubishi Motors you have a five years warranty on the old models also the brake light are up there it is up there we have a big big windows in the back window and also nice design here and very simple uh, on the back of the car I don't know if you can see that opening the car I want to open the light for you guys to show you the light and to see the car comes with this uh, light in the back I don't know if you can see it because it's daytime but they look very nice the, the light look really really beautiful and also in the front I want to go fast and show you that we have LED daylight right here in the front you can see it's blinking uh, on my on my camera but normally uh, it doesn't anyway the front of the car it's quite interesting with a lot of chrome here on the side we also have here the fog lamp the sensors parking sensors on the side uh, in the middle down here we have some chrome design nice interesting chrome design with some plastic gray down here um, also here we have as you can see combination of um, Xenon light, I think it's LED light with normal bulb light for the blinking That's pretty cool And also going on the other side the same same model on the side here uh, Around the edges of the car. We have this plastic small plastic part to protect the paint of the car in time to not rust from chips and stones something that it's really really great great idea also I see on many cars these days also on the down part the same plastic to protect the edges of the car even in the back there uh, it is a really really great idea the rims look also nice I like them they are very very beautiful I'm not sure how big they are they are 18 inch wheels so we have 18 inch wheels on this SUV and it look fabulous really really beautiful really nice um, now that you see the exterior I want to show you the interior of the car a little bit too so let's open the trunk so usually we have 
um, electric lift gate here we have the entrance in the car almost flat um, we have a flat entrance here in the trunk here we have some speaker as you can see really big it take a lot of place some space storage space on the side as well as here because this car usually it is a seven seater so you can take this seat up from here but I will show you a little bit later and also two cup holders for the seater in the back again some storage here uh, on the side and under this we have the repair kit and a small space where you can put your stuff also you can take this out normally from here so you can put it under here I think it's not so hard to do it now anyway yeah anyway let's go um, let's go in the back of the car the trunk it's really big because this car it's a really really huge car and it's really spacious anyway going here in the back of the car um, to show you the space better so leaving the seats down uh, as well from here you can put it in the front if you want to sit back here so just show you fast how the seats are taking place but I, I don't want to take this out I just show you like that so you can see you have a lot of space there in the back also you have a light for the the back passengers also you have again a light here bulb light no no LED light just a normal bulb light and also you can adjust the seat the way you want it as you can see down here you have adjustment manually adjustment so you can put the, the seat in every position you want oh, it's so annoying this light I just want to turn it off shut up okay better now let's go inside so as I say you can adjust it the way you want it something that it's a really really great thing I like that down there we don't have a big step so people that stay in the middle will stay very easy let's finish here in the back so in the back as I say you have enough space to stay here even for the for the legs you have enough space if you know how to adjust the front seat you have a lot of space in the back anyway putting back the seats the seat are, are uh, are very good and great quality you can see leather we have leather seats here um, and also you can leave it on the back and you have great comfort here in the middle we have a center armrest with two cup holder really useful uh, these days really really useful uh, the door it's everywhere uh, kind of plastic but it's look nice also we have leather here with nice stitches uh, the button for the windows, some storage space and the speaker down there going inside the car and then uh, let's close the door because there's so much noise outside we have leather great quality with the white stitches a lot of space storage space here as well a lot of space for my legs huge space for my legs I can even play and stretch my legs a lot of space no complaining um, we have a handle here, my head space, huge, huge space and I'm really comfortable in this car. I feel as I have a great, great visibility on the windows as well and also I feel like this car is pretty big and I have a lot of space here. Even in the middle, if I go in the middle, I have a lot of space, I can stay with my legs together something that's really cool so if you fit you can fit three per person here three people without problem vents usb port down here and also I'm not sure what's this nothing just usb port no 12 volt port the space in the middle it's kind of okay two three fingers but i can go a little bit front and then i have more space and then space in the left space in the right a lot of space huge space I like that I also like this uh, sunroof little window here um, little glass I was expecting to have more glass I like the car that have much more glass on the roof than this 
the dashboard and everything there look really um, simple and interesting nothing fancy nothing super expensive just simple things also in the back it's great visibility on the windows and also you can see the space there for the third row anyway let's go out it's pretty pretty hot inside here let's go outside let's go in the front uh, as i show you before maybe or not we have blind spot technology and nice big mirrors as well as in the front we have a different design on the doors we have a speaker here we have great leather quality soft material i like this design here it's kind of glossy plastic uh, interesting design also better quality than in the back we have soft material over down here again leather and great great uh, stitches and great materials quality on the doors um, the, here are the buttons for the window also great quality uh, the roof handle nice nice quality on the roof here we have the mirror great mirror with a bulb light uh, and I like that I like that you have a lot of space in this car even the mirror it's huge and you have great great visibility in the back bulb light here simple nothing complicated the visibility on the windows it's fantastic great big windows great visibility in the back even if the, the the car have a back camera you have a great visibility in the back i like it very much going forward we have great soft soft material quality on the on the uh, dashboard here really great and soft the vents we have a lot of vents in the car you can see it i like that in the summer it's fantastic and also the glow box it's pretty big i like the glow box we have a space up here and again a space down here great job mitsubishi great job now here the design it's also very simple we have the multimedia system here um, i will show you a little bit later but first time let's close the door anyway uh, colors the multimedia system I'm not sure if you see it before i will show you later but now i want to say that i like this this black glossy plastic around here the echo button blinkers here some information about the car um here we have the climatic system so you can start it and close it uh, very simple and easy to use down here we have 12 volt port we have again uh, the, the sensors for the blind spot technology heating steering wheel 12 volt port and that you know what it is down here we have some black glossy plastic two cup holders down here very useful and i like this stick mitsubishi keep this stick for a long time so i have a mitsubishi lancer before a few years ago and i have the same stick i like it it's really cool it feel great it's leather and it's really nice and small great automatic car four-wheel drive button we have electric handbrake also auto hold and we have the i think this i think those are i'm not sure i want to i want to test it oh yes those are the ventilated seat if i'm not wrong Ah oh, no, this car doesn't have the ventilated seat. I think this is the this is the heating on the seat. The heating on the seat button are right here. So the, this car doesn't have the ventilated seat. Anyway, um, I want to show you the dashboard as well. Um, it's very nice and simple. In the middle, we have a digital display with all the information about the car. Um, you can also change it from here I think modes I'm not sure wait a second where you can change this ah yeah I like this button here for the cameras you can see the car have cameras around it it's really great um, it's really great feature so you can see around the car what is around the car this is really great thing also where 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 is this i don't know where is the modes of driving 
how can you change that mode there or you cannot change it it's just stay like that I'm not sure okay I'm not sure about that anyway let's close the engine because it's make noise the steering wheel it's also great great quality great leather much better than in the other cars so they use a, a very good quality leather on this steering wheel I like the black black glossy here also the chrome and the buttons that I don't know all the buttons sorry about that here I know it's the adaptive cruise control and the cruise control and all that stuff here are the, the clappers for changing the gear manually uh, pretty nice star stop button you see it before and yeah here we have a glow oh, armrest leather with great stitches a lot of space down here pretty nice and I also like this seat are beautiful we have side support great leather quality and also they are electric adjustable i think i show you before you can adjust every position you want you can see it's pretty awesome maybe you can see like that better so you can put it in every position you want and it's work very fast it's great i like that i really like it anyway i think i can sh i show you everything in this car oh maybe the the option let me show you some information about the car i'm sure you're interesting about the consumption around 6.4 149 grams um 1600 kilogram euro 6 petrol engine and then the price and all that stuff we have 150 horsepower uh, two liter you can see the engine black line also um the year it's 2019 the price 36,900 wow i didn't expect that it's a great price guys wow so cheap you have also a discount if you come here in bern you are from switzerland you can come in bern emil fry ag auto center blah 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 you can check out on the website they have a great price for such a big suv i didn't expect to be so cheap 36,000. really great wow really impressive a nice car a big huge car indeed it doesn't have a great great tech with led for example led light inside the car it doesn't have it it has just this normal light but um the point it's it's a big car with a lot of space great engine great technology also adaptive cruise control and all that stuff it's really impressive that it has with radar and all that things um, yes I forget to show you this navigation system I think it's a great great price for a great car and also the seat are leather don't forget that's really impressive now I show you a little bit here uh, on this navigation system so you have here application and all that stuff it's charging Dolby volume and all that stuff great it has to be it is a, it is a touch screen display I never used it before it has the glossy it's a matte display so if we go to home we have here all the information you can connect to Bluetooth we have application we have car information about the car about the consumption and all that stuff um, I want to open the door just a little bit because it's very hot here or maybe or maybe open the climatic system uh, it's very hot anyway now here you can see all that information about the car blah, 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 blah. telephone blah 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 it's work fine it's not perfect but it's work fine going to home here we have some information about the car uh, that you can change it uh, where is the navigation system day night the GPS application where is the navigation I don't know climatic system home maybe here an app no it doesn't have I don't know where is the navigation GPS maybe yeah but I don't know I don't know I don't know maybe you can 
give me some tips I don't see where is the navigation system in this car anyway that was my review guy with the car yeah multimedia system it's so so nothing fancy but at this money what you can expect um, anyway I like the car um, the navigation it's simple I think um, if you're not so fancy uh, you can do a great job with this car anyway I hope you enjoyed the review guys I hope it was helpful please subscribe to my channel check out my other videos um, on my channel and if you want to see a test drive or all other if you have any requests or feedbacks please please write me and tell me what you think thank you for watching again don't forget if you want to buy this mitsubishi outlander with this amazing price you have to come in bern at emil fry garage they have a lot of cars here um, with great technology and great prices so thank you for watching see you soon guys bye